results every single year are better in Northern Ireland than the rest of the UK. I'd also point out to him that his own party leader at the time, um, David Cameron, he told his party conference some years ago now that we, we have uh, the worst rate of social mobility in the developed world. And that's after 50 or 60 years of comprehensive education. Now, I've taught much of my career in comprehensive schools, and you have got some very good comprehensive schools. Uh, Lord Lucas's book, The Good School Guide, tells you where the good schools are. But mostly, if you want to go to one of those good schools, you have to buy a house in the catchment area. And when they appear in Lord Lucas's book, the price of the houses go up. You're 27 times more likely to go to a failing school if you live in a poor area of the country. So if you ask me, do we need more grammar schools? Yes, we need hundreds of more grammar schools, particularly in areas of social deprivation. And we need also alongside those grammar schools, a new generation of technical schools so that children who aren't academic, but they have a chance to develop their vocational uh, skills. So I think we do need more grammar schools, or, or at the very least, we need bilateral schools where there's a grammar stream. And don't forget in this argument, when we got rid of grammar schools or most grammar schools, we also got rid of the grammar school exam, the GCE O level. And interestingly, that was a, that was a tough exam. And we don't we ban it here, but we export it to Singapore. And where are Singapore and the international league tables? Top of the table. So we've got to not only look at bringing back grammar schools, we've got to do what Michael Gove specifically wanted to do is bring back the grammar school exam for kids who are bright academically. And, but don't get the idea that somehow if you're academically bright, you're better. You're not because vocational training is equally important. Engineers are equally important to people like me. I'm a historian. So we've got to get away from that terrible snobbery that grammar school means better. No, it's different. Germany works very well. Switzerland, it works very well. So we need grammar schools. We need choice. And we need to get some fairness back into our system and not have it based on house prices. Mm. Do you know, I did... Uh, I